Hi Pisces, the Awakened Dreamer here to give you your weekly tarot reading for the week of April 25th to May 1st, 2022. Thank you so much for joining me and do keep in mind this is general for the week so just take what resonates and as well I want to thank you in advance for your love and support by liking, commenting and of course subscribing to this channel if you haven't done so already. Um, they are speaking about temptation already as they're drawing me to my snake ring but uh, to book a personal reading with me just reach out via email i'll definitely get that started for you everything you need is down below in the description box and don't forget to stick with me to the very end of the reading this video to get an answer to your own yes or no question which um i'll answer at that point hope i said that right as i'm spoken through but the song that spirit chose to speak upon your week on shuffle untouched by the veronica's untouched love this song i'll leave it down below for you to utilize in one way, shape, or form. I was healing, um, interesting, I was healing. Uh, didn't mean to say that. What I was going to express was that um, I was hearing that you're not feeling too thrilled in certain ways uh, for the most part throughout the week. Feeling a level of emotion come to be even if you don't want to admit it or show it to anybody for that matter right? Trying to put up a facade potentially, desiring a new beginning or trying to make the best out of one um, that you started recently, okay? Within your finances, if I didn't say that already. Feeling a bit out of it, I feel the need to say. Feeling, uh, oh, we're jumping right into it, by the way, pulling just tarot from the tattoo tarot deck. Um, things are feeling a bit shuffled, a bit out of order, a bit confusing. Um, you feeling as if you just don't get how things are meant to proceed. Um, feeling a little bit cloudy in your life for whatever reason, a bit foggy potentially. Um, you could find that you just are pushed spiritually just to either um, black out like in a, for a brief moment or you just feel very um, out of it once again. Uh, you could feel a bit defensive at certain points uh, due to being very tired, confused, or just burnt out. Ten of Cups, all right? Feeling as if you need more fulfillment, more happiness, but just feeling a bit confused as to how that's meant to come to be. Wanting more intuition at times, interesting, but you have a lot of which within you. Just at times it's hard to put your finger on it or tap into it. I need to trust how you feel in regards to a certain situation or how energy is affecting you, okay? Allow for your body to speak to you in that sense. Very interesting reading thus far, as you are being pushed to recognize that you are very much protected. I was just thinking about the song Untouched. Um, yeah, that's the name of it. <laughs> Judgment uh, coming out as well. Feeling quite judgmental in certain ways, even if you're not expressing it. Uh, you could just have moments where you're migrating around, accomplish things, or even at work or within your living situation. You overhear something uh, not so lovely, I feel the need to say, or just other people being judgmental, gossipy, um, or I, I was just given the image of somebody turning and looking at somebody like, why are you wearing that? Or why did you just do that? Right? Um, you may just be experiencing some outrageous behavior. Interesting. This is going to be a random week where you're thinking about your fulfillment and feeling the inclination at certain points to compare or just to uh, push to recognize that you are better than certain people. I don't know why you're getting that push um, because you need to understand that you have made so much progress in your life. I feel like you, um, I hope that came out right, but I just feel as if you're pushed to recognize that secrecy is not a bad thing at this point as I feel like you're going through a lot internally and I feel as if to ease one's concerns, right? To relax one's mind, to let you move forward in a smoother way um, or to help you move forward in a smoother way, if I can even spit it out, um, abundance comes in, okay? It's not just money. It could be for some, but I do feel as if you are getting clarification on the past, something that has been so, um, a big question mark in one's mind in regards to why that happened, why they came to an end, or just a blank needs to be filled in so you can stop thinking about it, or so you can just close that chapter up for good, right? In, in your mind, um, your dreams, your heart, your soul. I know that sounds dramatic, but I feel like 
you're feeling a bit traumatic and just, again, a bit foggy at certain points in the week, clearing up a little bit of fog in regards to your past. That's how we're going to put it. Feeling burnt out in a lack of color. Okay. This deck is beautiful due to having uh, two versions of some of the cards. And in this case, there's one that's colored in and one that is lacking color. Okay. As you're thinking about your fulfillment and feeling a bit confused, once again, you're asking oneself or being pushed to ask oneself, why is the color feeling stripped away at this point? How do I get it back? Right? It doesn't mean you need to overwork oneself, overstress, overthink about it. But it's more simplistic than one would think, right? Than you want to make it at times. It just feels like there's certain uh, aspects of your life that you're missing. And it, puzzle pieces, if you will, is what they're showing. Um, you're going to figure it out moving forward. Probably not this week, but it is a week where you need to begin that mental sorting out process, right? Some cleaning up potentially needs to happen in regards to your habits. Um, but again, thinking about energy, situations, how it affects you, right? Um, Motivation-wise, uh, vibration-wise, right? Color-wise, okay? Um, they're saying it's time to color things in, okay? Um, there's going to be, there's going to be, excuse me, a focus on art for some of you, okay? Um, reading will help you as well. That came out in one of the other water signs. You're going to feel very connected to somebody at the week, uh, during the week. Um, at a certain point, it's just going to feel like um, they expect you to be happier than you feel in that moment. And it's like, you're not going to feel like forcing it, period, okay? And you, nor should you have to. It's like at certain points, you might feel the need to put up a facade, but then for the majority of the week, it's like, I am not going to force it. I'm not feeling super colorful, super up to it. A little bit foggy once again, that keeps coming up. Um, they're saying, watch the, the fog dissipate as you move into the upcoming weeks. Do keep that in mind. All right. It's part of why you were drawn to this reading. Um, we can't always have super amazing weeks, right? Um, we can do our best, but I, it's about being honest and true to how you're feeling and what you're going through so that you can just move forward and on a healthier note. This is coming out again. Did it not already come out or is that a different reading? Again, a little bit forgetful, um, not realizing something you did. You're gonna completely forget what you did, but it's purposeful because I feel like you would have overthought it or you would have um, forgot to do something after it. Ugh, very spiritually connected. Abundance is coming in, my friend. All right, they're showing literally somebody dropping coins into somebody's hands feeling as if somebody's helping you out in a, in a very abundant way. It helps you breathe a little bit more, okay? They're saying you should thank that person. Helping hands coming towards Pisces when you most need it, right? When you're feeling most burnt out. Uh, being pushed to recognize that people are seeing you in a very wise light, okay? Very knowledgeable. It's like you don't always flaunt your uh, knowledge, your wisdom, your experience. But when you need to get the job done, it shows you know what you're doing, right? It shows that you've got the intelligence to back it up. And if need be, you can defend oneself, your work, whatever the case may be. But in regards to a wish fulfillment you desire in the future, it may be wrapped up with your money or work, but I feel as if you are pushed to recognize you have what it takes to accomplish that and to, to manifest it, but to make the best out of it when the time comes. I feel like you desire a big switch up and you have for a while. The stars are aligning for you, but it's not going to fully feel like it throughout the week or for the majority of which, but don't let that get the best of you or get you down as I feel like you're going to get a taste of justice towards the weekend and that's going to help you recognize that your cup is meant to be overflowing with abundance, that there's a fresh start in the future for you that you just will be so damn happy to embark upon, but even more so just to kind of learn the way on the way or just to utilize your past experiences to um, conquer within that beginning, that situation. However that pertains to you, Pisces, I'm feeling so much brighter, happier. They're giving me goosebumps as we start to speak upon, um, or as we continue to speak upon these two cards. You're putting, being pushed to recognize that you deserve romance in your life as well. You're being pushed to more so recognize that in, as the abundance flows in, as you don't feel your best at certain points of the week, you get what you need when you need it period, right? But you deserve to live a life that you love, that makes you feel colorful, fulfilled, and doesn't just feel mundane and like you're just going through the motions. That's key, okay? 
You may feel like you just have to check things off a to-do list, have to do what you got to do, go to work, come back, or run your business, you know. Um, you're going to find that things feel more uh, spicy moving forward is what they're saying, more enjoyable, more colorful. This week is a week where you have to recognize what's right for you and what's not. Even energies once again, okay? Just take a deep breath as it's going to be a week of learning, growth, and um, transformation to say the least. Let's answer your question. Four Pisces. Alrighty, you're getting an answer of yes. You got a yes. So I hope this was truly helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Go have yourself an amazing week, and I'll definitely see you next time. Bye, Pisces.